Environmental education is the process that leads to a more environmentally literate citizenry. You're probably familiar with literacy as the ability to read and write, but literacy can also relate to a specific topic, like computer literacy or scientific literacy. And it's more than just knowing about the topic. As part of an initiative to assess environmental literacy, a 2011 report and framework by NAAEE defined an environmentally literate person as someone who both individually and together with others makes informed decisions concerning the environment, is willing to act on these decisions to improve the well-being of other individuals, societies, and the global environment, and participates in civic life. This framework for environmental literacy also broke literacy down into a series of four interrelated components, knowledge, dispositions, competencies, and environmentally responsible behavior. Let's try and picture what an environmentally literate person looks like. Knowledge is what fills our head with information about physical, ecological, social, cultural, and political systems. Hmm. Dispositions reflect the heart, our feelings towards the environment, sensitivity to environmental issues, and the motivation to work for a more positive future. Competencies are the muscles of literacy, the skills to investigate, analyze, evaluate, and make informed decisions. These muscles allow us to take what is in our head and heart and put that into action. This action, environmentally responsible behavior, mm. is the ultimate expression of environmental literacy and shows up as how we choose to live our lives, from what we eat, to how we get around, to how we work with others at home, in our communities, and in the world. Although increasing environmental literacy is a result of environmental education, it isn't really an endpoint. There is no end. We're always learning and the issues we face are constantly changing. Working for a sustainable future is a lifelong process that builds over time and helps us continue to learn about how we adapt to changing technologies, society, and the planet.